Hi guys, it's me, Teacher Gon. In our today's video, we will talk about how to find the vertex of a quadratic function. So without further ado, let's do this topic. This one will be a quick video because we will try to find the vertex of a given quadratic function. And what we have here is y is equal to x squared minus 2x minus 3. So remember guys that the vertex of a quadratic function or a parabola is represented by h comma k. This h is your x coordinate. This k is your y coordinate. And the formula that we're going to use tonight or for today's video is this. For h, we will use negative b over 2a. And for k, we will use the formula f of negative b over 2a. So let's try finding the vertex of this given function y is equal to x squared minus 2x minus 3. First, we will determine the value of a and b. In this function, the value of a is 1 here. Your a is 1. Your b is negative 2. To find the value of h, let us substitute using the formula negative b over 2a, that is negative, times your b which is negative 2, so this is negative. So what we have now is negative b which is negative 2 over 2 times, this is 2a, 2 times your a which is equal to 1. Let us simplify the values. Negative times negative is positive. So this is 2 over 2 times 1, which is equal to 2. And definitely, the value of your h is equal to 1. So now let's move on and find the value of k. Remember guys, that this h is also equal to x. So to use this formula, k is equal to f of negative b over 2a, what we need to do is just, we will plug in the value of h or x, which is equal to 1, to this given formula. And also, we also remember guys that your k is equal to y, meaning we can replace y as k. So it will become k is equal to x squared minus 2x minus 3. Again, your k is the y-coordinate, meaning this is equal to y. So this y, pwede natin siyang palitan bilang k. And now, we will plug in the value of x or h, which is 1. So this is 1 squared minus 2 times 1 minus 3. Your k is equal to 1 squared, which is 1, negative 2 times 1, which is negative 2, then minus 3. Simplifying this, you have 1 minus 2, that is negative 1, minus 3, that is negative 4. So right now, the value of k is negative 4. So what is the vertex of this given quadratic function? The vertex is simply vertex simply 1 comma negative 4. So you guys, I hope you learned something from this video on how to calculate or find the vertex of a given quadratic function or a parabola. So if you're new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe but hit na rin yung bell button for you to be updated sa ating latest uploads. Again, it's me, Teacher Gon. Maraming maraming salamat. Bye-bye!